So, okay, YouTube, I'm coming to you. Rondi 15, Rondi 71. I got to figure out which one is my screen name. I just finished my workout. I ran two miles earlier and just finished eating dinner. I just wanted to start documenting my hair journey for all those other ladies that have been documenting their hair journey. My inspirations are You Love Megs, Pretty J Watts, Chavez, Candy, Kiss, I mean Tracy. It's just so many out there that I've been following for such a long time. And I just wanted to come and document how far I've come since 2009 and back again. This was a protective style. I had it braided on one side um, just for the day. And I just wanted to come and let you know how I moisturize and seal my hair. I am currently this week, tomorrow actually will be 11 weeks post relaxer. My last relaxer was January 5th of this year. I did a seven month stretch before then and I'm starting to do either three or four month stretches from now on just so I could have healthier hair and prolong my relaxers. So since starting uh, my hair journey, I was natural at one point back in 07 to like 08 and I wanted to go back to the relaxer. As you can see, I have a lot of new growth in my hair. I have been using different hair tips until I find what really works for my hair. So I'm doing the MN challenge. I'm doing the bun challenge for 30 days. I'm doing no heat until I do my relaxer, which even when I do that, I think I'm still just going to do roller set on big rollers and sit under the dryer and then just wrap it doing the blowout or the Dominican um, style, Dominican blowout style, but I'm not going to blow it out because I'll have a fresh relaxer. So I started the Minoconsole Mina Nitrate Challenge from Chavez Candy. I love her hair. It is so healthy, so gorgeous. That is the length that I want mine. My hair is probably currently at um, almost on the seven line on my length check shirt. So it's right, right, right above bra strap length BSL. And my goal is to have my hair on my breasts by my next relaxer. At least I'm hoping that it's there. And that's probably like three or four inches of growth, which I'm thinking I should have by now. But if not, that is going to be my goal for my next stretch, which will be in August. My relax will be in August. So I've already kind of planned out my year as far as my relaxers and the relaxer stretches. My natural hair is probably like a 4B, 4C. <laughs> it's really coil, really tight um, curls. And my hair does like a lot of moisture. I've just noticed that lately. So I've just been trying to keep it. You can see all this new growth in here. I've been trying to keep it moisturized and just trying the different tips until I find what really works for my hair. Um... I'm going to use tonight to seal it the MN mix with my Soft and Beautiful Botanicals Moisturizer that you can use on your scalp. I just kind of mix the whole MN bottle or um, tube, the seven day tube in my moisturizer and I'm just going to use this on my scalp. I have all my oils mixed together in this applicator bottle. I'll just shake it up when I get ready to apply it to my scalp. I have um, extra virgin olive oil, I have um, some glycerin, I have the rest of my Grow New Hair treatment that was mixed with a bunch of oils. I had ordered that from an organic um, store online and I just took the rest of that. It was probably that much left and I just put it in there with the mixture of my oils. I have some um, grapeseed oil in there and I, I didn't add any um, coconut oil. And I think that's all of the oils that are in there. So I'm just going to use that. And then in this spray, spray bottle, it's just an 8-ounce spray bottle from the dollar store that I've had forever. It has my glycerin in here and it has the S-Curl um, products in there. Um, I probably 
probably put that away somewhere. And that's what's in this spray bottle with some Infusion 23 leave-in conditioner. I keep everything under the cabinet. Here's the grapeseed oil. And here's the Infusion 23 leave-in conditioner that I use as my moisturizing mist on my new growth only. So I'm just going to go ahead and... Um, must um, put the moisturize my scalp with the MM mixture and massage it in. Spritz the um, my my moisturizing spritz on my new growth only, and then I'm gonna put some oil on my scalp out of this applicator bottle, and then I'm going to seal my ends with my coconut oil, and then just probably put the same braid back in and tie it up for the night. So I'll be back. <laughs> 